Huawei has shown off the first driverless car to be controlled with his standard smartphone. The Roadreader project uses Huawei AI within its flagship Huawei Mate 10 Pro to control a specially adapted Porsche Panamera. For added jeopardy, the company challenged itself to go from zero to not killing a dog in five weeks. The AI technology is exactly the same tech that the phone uses in its camera and can not only see, but also understand the surroundings, identifying thousands of objects, cats, dogs, old ladies, bollards, you get the idea. Huawei believes that by using the same technology that it is offering consumers through its smartphones, it is able to demonstrate the ability to bring the technology to the masses, rather than reinvent the wheel with bespoke tech like Waymo and Uber. Our smartphone is already outstanding at object recognition. We wanted to see if in a short space of time we could teach it to not only drive a car, but to use its AI capabilities to see certain objects, and be taught to avoid them said Andrew Garrahy, Chief Marketing Officer at Huawei Europe. If our technology is intelligent enough to achieve this in just five weeks, what else can it make possible? Huawei is taking the ultimate gamble with Roadreader. It will be letting delegates at this year's MWC loose with it, allowing them to control a car and teach it to avoid certain objects. It's going to be like owning a life-sized big track. And we'll be there, and we've been promised to go. And if the Porsche doesn't crash, it won't be because of our skillful driving, that's for certain. We'll let you know how we do. You can see how they went about designing the smartphone-controlled car below with an absolutely terrified-looking dog. Don't worry, HES fine. In fact, HES a good boy. We hope he WASNT subject 294 or something, is all, micro.